Arcade Improv. Arcade Improv. Pew! Start. Welcome back to Arcade Improv. Welcome back. I'm Ladies Mish. and gentle cousins. This is Mish. She's amazing. She said Hi. that already. I'm Hi. Lauren. That's Lauren. Yup. Okay. And uh, we're playing some Katamari. And it's it's been a little bit. Yeah, it's been a couple of minutes. It has. Yeah. It, yeah, I think it's been like since November. Since like three months ago. Has it seriously been that long? Yeah. Oh my goodness. It was, it was right after we came back from the improv. Uh, the Denver Improv Festival. That's right. That's right. Okay. Mm -hmm. Wow. It's uh, that's crazy. Cause I've been watching. You know, cause I'm a narcissist. Uh, I've been watching <laughs> hours as they come out, and it's uh, it's fun to relive them because I'd forgotten some of the conversations that we had. I was watching some of them too. Yeah. I totally didn't read what the king just said, and usually it's one of the most entertaining entertaining parts of this game. I apologize to everybody. <laughs> <laughs> it's alright, they can uh, It says loading your anus. Loading! Oh, yeah. no, it has the other ones. Earth, Venus. Okay. So, I don't know what I'm supposed to be getting. Uh, well, you can watch him now, and he'll tell you. It's Katamari in the city this time around. You start bigger, too, or you get squished. Woo! Woo! So much activity. So much activity. Getting distracted. You sound like me. He's got ADD. I do. King I, of all cosmoses. He's like he's like the the worst best character ever. Ah, oh, twenty five meters. Fuck yeah. Uh, but uh, yeah, that's really big. Yeah, it is. That's yeah, you're gonna get to pick up cars. <gasps> you're gonna get to pick up maybe small buildings. Oh, that's amazing. Related oh, to the ocean. Stuff. So, like, all them fish and... That's right, I said them fish. Get them, get them fish. It's big gas giants, I think big ships. Okay, shit. Here we go. Go, girl. Let's go. Do it, do it. Oh, ah. get those car. get them. Get that car. What are you guys like, that thing? That just seemed like that'd be easy to pick up. Um, so... Oh, yeah, this is great. I'm so excited. Ah! ah. No, go away, you people. Uh, I feel like you were gonna, like, fly through this real fast. I don't know. I watched us have some serious trouble this the last <laughs> round, so, I mean, who knows? Anything could happen. You could blow through this your first time and just be like, shapow! That would take a lot of uh, luck. You could go in there if you want to and roll up some littler stuff. I mean... Do you? You do you. I won't tell you what to do. I just see all this stuff all over the place. Yeah, know. well, I that's the point. You have you have all of the I things. To all of also, the, uh, the people who live in these towns and cities are the the slobbiest, most. <laughs> Thank they, goodness. They just leave their shit everywhere. I'm so glad. I know it is. It is very. Uh, it, would it would be, be hard to do Katamari if there wasn't as much stuff just like sitting everywhere. everywhere. Hey, you! I was trying to pick you up. Ah. Nope. Oh not yeah, yet. you're too. You're not. You're not big enough for the potties. You're getting close. It's starting to get hard to move. Hey, what up? Pick up that kid. I got a person. I got a person. Yeah, pick up all those kids. Pick up all those motherfucking kids. We need people. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Why won't you get up? Why won't you get up? Um. Nope. Can't get full people yet. Um, words. It's hard to talk and play this game. <laughs> I know. I should be more helpful. Because I'm so... I should be. I should be more helpful, like uh, starting conversations. So, speaking of I'm things sorry. that are helpful, I can't oh, you've see got things. It. You, you can do this. Oh, get the prezi! <gasps> what? Oh, the present! There was a present. Look, Where? there's a present right there. Get, 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 get! Yeah! Woo! Holy hornbeam! Horn Fantastic. <laughs> Um, but anyway, so speaking of uh, listening to ourselves talk about things, I listened to the episode where we talked about um, Headspace. Uh huh. And I headspaced. Did you? Yes. It's been more than 10 days since I listened to uh, that particular episode, and I have not gotten through all 10 days of Headspace yet. But I have enjoyed it every time uh, I've done it. I get this really weird, like, tingling, tingling sensation. The very top of my. Uh, Scalp? I don't know if that's like a common thing. Oh, get all those fucking kids! Oh, yes! Oh, yes! <gasps> it's 
so satisfying when you pick up all of the things. I can't pretend. Got you. I got you. I got you. Yeah. I got you. I got you. Oh, so I want to get a different view. How do I see the other side? Oh, like that. Yeah, that. girl. Yeah. Get people. Get people. Get it, motherfucker. <laughs> oh, you're going down. Yeah, you got a cousin. You got a cousin. The weird pink one that looks like a fucked up thing. Ah, uh, trees. How do I get? I feel like I need to get big enough. Just keep picking up the things, like, I mean, I, it's really boring for me to tell you this, but, uh, just, like, keep picking up the things. Especially uh, once you know you can pick up a particular thing, like, pick up all of those things. Like, if you know that you can pick up kids, pick up all the goddamn kids you can see. Like, if you know that you can pick up, like, bicycles, pick up all the fucking, like, just as, as soon as you know that you're big enough to pick something up, like, go after all of those things. Anything you can tell that's smaller. I just got all the people! Yeah, fuck yeah! Get them people! All the people! Get the people! You can do this! You can I do it! You can do it! I got the people! Yeah, girl! Also, I think it's really funny that, uh... You really have, uh, like, made everything a competition in your other episodes. <laughs> it's so not a competition between us, and I really like it. Well, it's funny, though, like, I was listening to Yoshi's Island, and I'm like, oh, I made it into a competition. But the truth is, like, Casey made it into a competition, and then I continued it. <laughs> and, uh, ladies and gentlemen, for the record, he's over here, like, shrugging his shoulders, like, what I do? I made it a competition with Gabby, though, for sure. <laughs> Gabby doesn't, Gabby doesn't compete about anything. Oh, she's so nice. Gabby's, like Gabby's the, nice the best. Such a sweetheart. Um, you might be able to start picking up parked cars. Definitely not that thing, though. No, not that. <gasps> phone booth! You picked up that person in a phone booth. He'll think twice about making phone calls. Could you imagine if, like, you oh were in a God. phone booth and this huge, like, would not be thing stressful, came at you? Just like got you, and you're like, what? No! If you survive, you have PTSD call? for the rest of your yeah. It'd be pretty gosh bad. darn life. It'd be pretty bad. Okay, where are parked cars so I can get them? Uh, behind you. You need to go back where you were. Oh, hey, look at those police people. They're trying to shoot me? <laughs> yeah, they sure are. That's cute. Yeah, once you get big enough, the police people are like, no, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no. Uh, I don't know what you think you're doing, but uh, it's not hanging out here. Uh, Rick Shaw Man! Oh, wait. Oh, yeah. There we go. There we go. Yeah, there we go. There we there we go. go. Like that. Right there. And then up that hill. Oh, yeah, get those sticks. Oh, up the hill. Okay. But yeah, you know. Get those things, too. Fence, 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 fence. Yes, and then children. Yes, pick up all of the children. At this point, you might be able to pick park up park car. Yeah. yeah. How about this guy? This like truck. Uh, uh, you can go. Car. You can go run around and pick him up again because you, you bounced him. Oh, uh, I got rid of the. Oh shit! Dang, man. Yeah, girl, get all of the things. Look at these trucks. Look at these trucks. Oh, look at that cow. Yeah. Oh, oh you're gonna fucking do it. I don't know about that. How much time do I have? You got a minute left. I got like double you got the time. Two minutes. You've got two minutes. You're good. You can do this. I have faith in you. You have more faith in me than I have in me. No, don't do oh, that. Oh, I'm almost close to the house, but not quite. Um. That you should do. Here we go. So headspace. Headspace. Um. I'm now, what I've been using, so I, I subscribed for a year, but like it's, you know, a little bit pricey. It is a little bit. Like, it's, I don't know, it's something I'm seriously considering, but at the same time, it's like, I don't know. Well, the other thing about it, though, is like. money doing so many other things. Well, the thing about it is, like, if you don't get it the first time, like, they'll send you, like, different things in the email, like, hey, we'll discount it to this. Hey, we'll discount it to this until you get it. Yeah, and then they never give you that offer again. Yeah, so I, I got the discount. Um, yeah. Well, then they offered to let me sign up for a second year at the same time. Oh, that's not bad. Um, but problem is I'm broke right now. So, not broke, but I just don't feel like spending it right now. So I got um, uh, Insight Timer, which is another app. Uh-huh. Which is 100% free. Oh, that's nice. Um, it does, uh, if you uh, turn around and go behind you, because you can go up that hill. And now you're big enough to pick up buildings, you can you can actually do some damage. Alright, I'm trying to turn around. You got this. Yeah, right there. Keep going. There? Yeah, keep going. There? Keep going. All of those all of those things. Pick up all of those things. You'll be able to pick okay. up like these parts. Oh, fuck yeah, fuck yeah! Oh, I missed all those that. Alright, can I get these houses? 
Maybe they're gonna feed us. Oh uh, no. Okay. Okay. Um, but insight timer is like it's like anybody can submit whatever they want that they've made, like of their own um, meditations. Mm-hmm. And um uh nope, not even close. Alright, my thumbs hurt. I oh poor baby. Mmm. Alrighty, very nice. Very nice. The Katamari is 15. Isn't it fun to get big enough to like pick up people and cars mm -hmm. and shit? Like, mm -hmm. it's so satisfying. Because, mm -hmm. like, every time you pick something up, the controller vibrates in your hand. So, when you're big enough to just start picking up thing after thing, it's like a nice hand massage. Wait, it vibrates in your hand? I didn't even notice that. Yeah. It vibrates I... every, every time you pick <laughs> something up, it, it vibrates a little bit. What? We can't stand! No, you didn't. I must have misheard you. Sorry, Dad. Whatever. Con! Put that city ball down. I'm trying. So now that I've read the things that you could already read, um... Oh, uh-oh. We're about to get punished. Yeah. So I found out that, uh... This game, actually, I was wrong. Like, it, you only get points if you get hit by the ball, which is, like, super fucked. Oh, so it's backwards. Yeah. Yeah, you only get points if you get hit by something. Oh. Yeah. I guess that makes sense in Katamari, right? The balls are yeah. like trying to hit and pick up people. Yeah. Kind of. Oh, I'm off the tail. Oh, no, there I am. There you are again. Wow. That's such a weird, like, like, goal. Right. Isn't that so weird? It's like, what? That's just, it's kind of dark. It's backwards. It's kind of dark, in fact. I mean, this is all, all of this that you're seeing right now is super fucked up. It's weird. Yeah. It's some Japanese yeah. guy's, like, worst nightmare on mm -hmm. drugs. Mm-hmm. Yep. He, he, he hates his father, and this is what we get, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. So, so with that, we will leave you. Bye. Bye. Nihilism is a philosophical doctrine that suggests a lack of belief in one or more reputedly meaningful aspects of life. Most commonly, nihilism is presented with the form of existential nihilism, which argues that life is without objective meaning, purpose, or intrinsic value. The end. The end. Now I re-silence. <laughs>